Lao Tzu, formerly named Lao Dan, was a great philosopher and thinker in Chu country of ancient China. His hometown was Kuxian. Lao Tzu was the founder of Taoism. His philosophical ideas exerted great influence on Taoism, Confucianism, and legalism. Even Confucius also consulted Lao Tzu about the knowledge of rules and etiquette. There was civil unrest in the court. After several disasters caused by war, Luoyang city was not prosperous anymore. Civilian life was getting worse. You're Lao Dan, aren't you? Yes, it's me. How are you? Not good. The court and military keep collecting our food. What do you think is not good in these times? In my opinion, there are too many talents. Those talents who feel superior and always want to get more power and benefit. They keep fighting. As a result, the civilians suffer from their fights. If there were no talents, how would you manage such a big country? Why do we need such a big country? I think just some villages and thousands of people is enough for an entire country. People do farming and herding sheep and weaving to make a good life for themselves. Isn't that good enough? No talents, no fighting. Even two villages next to each other. They won't fight with each other. There will be peace in the land. Lao Dan thought for a moment. He thought what the old man said made sense. Let the civilians manage themselves, live their own lives. That means no conflict. Lao Dan managed book collection and resigned to go back to his hometown because of war and unrest. When Lao Dan came to Hangulguan, he was unexpectedly welcomed by Governor Yin Xi. We haven't known each other before. How can I be entertained so well? Master, you are a wise man that ever there was one. You deserve it. I hope to be your student and hand down your knowledge to future generations. I do not have any valuable knowledge. What made you say so? Your opinion about the heaven and philosophy was a truth to the world. If you insist on this, I'd like to write an essay about Taoism, describing the philosophy. Another essay about morality, describing how to conduct the world. A philosophy described cannot last. If it can be titled, that means it will not last. Lao Dan spent three days on this 5,000-word essay, which is well known to later generations. People called it Lao Tzu, as well as moral precept.